Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and a very good morning to all my fellow friends. Today, I would like to talk about the advantage and disadvantage of online class. Learning is often considered to be a normal part of working and personal life. Both learning for achieving a job as well as for achieving knowledge should not be neglected. Online environment is changing continuously and it represents a great opportunity for learning. It is very important to discover how to learn using all available communication channels and choosing the one that the best suit a person's staff of filtering information. Nowadays, online learning turns out to be more and more practice. Many traditional universities started to share their courses online for free. It represents an easy and comfortable method to achieve knowledge in almost every field, from law and accounting to human resource and science, such as psychology and sociology or history. Online learning is a great alternative to traditional universities, especially for people who can't afford the time and money to take real courses. But what is the advantage and disadvantage of online learning? Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi everyone, my name is Nur Azwa Binti Azizuddin Sham. Here, I want to share with you about disadvantage and disadvantage of online class. First and foremost, I share about disadvantage of learning online class first. When we want to start an online class, we must have telecommunication facilities such as laptops, telephone and so on. Uh, in the absence of telecommunication facilities, will cause the assigned task to be disrupted. Advantage may also make us fail the subject we take for this semester. Besides, don't focus. Being online is free and you will not be overlooked. So it is very easy for you to lose focus or get tired of learning. You will miss something and maybe you will misunderstand something. Now we go to advantage. It's easier and you can do it everywhere. Even task is individual and requires more self-discipline. From this online learning, we can save money on this kind of learning. Do your homework online so we don't have to move from our home to go to, to, go to college. From there, we can save money on ship as well as food. In addition, we do not need to bring tasks as we would before. This before the subjects not if we do not want to because the content used is re reusable. The fact that online class are easier compared to on campus class is enough to convince you to consider them. As we can see nowadays with the COVID-19 situation, a lot of students, whether they are in university, 
college or high school and primary school students, all of these students should have to use some of internet online class such as Zoom, Webex, Google Meeting, and so on. There are lots of internet online class platforms that teachers or lecturers would use to give assignments to the students. Before I start my speech, I would like to say to all of the watchers in this case, whenever you are doing this conference, okay, let's go to the advantages. First of all, online class has a lot of advantage. As you can see, we will spot here the advantage and let you know why online class is needed to remain far away from school, university, and college. My point here is online class can bring us a cheaper and modern to students. The students can learn with any device that is connected to the internet, just like handphone, laptop, or tablet. There's no need to rent a building or pay for expensive utility bills that are required to provide students with a learning facility. In addition, students and teachers will no longer come to class, thereby, they will saving students' money as well. Other than that, most people today prefer to consume content using the internet. The very fact that you are watching this speech online is proof of that. We now use the internet to read news, watch our favorite TV show, chat with friends, book appointments, shop and much more. This advantage that people need to see now. Secondly, we go to the disadvantage of online class. Even nowadays, the online class helps a lot of students from being outdated to the subject they are learning, but of course, they still have the disadvantages of it. The disadvantages that I would like to speak is students can't understand the subject because they can't interact with people such as teachers, lecturers, and other students. Is this because the lack of communication during the online class? A few of students are introvert and doesn't respond to the subject that teachers and lecturers teach. The in fact that students do not have teachers and lecturers at their side to accompany them. However, is it true that traditional learning in the class where the full-time or part-time is much easier because your lecturers and teachers is same classroom with you and they can sit behind you or next to you to explain what you do not understand. Therefore, you can ask lots of questions to them. Only in a small group of person can develop properly. At school, students learn how to make friends, be patient, get rid of disappointment, and especially to compete. It is the disadvantages of online class that I can put here. We go to the next presenter that will speak about the third point of advantage and disadvantage of online class. Thank you for letting your ear. The advantages of e-learning Self-discipline and responsibility Who says that having to be more self-disciplined is a disadvantage? It is true that studying online requires more self-motivation and time management skill. Because you will spend a lot of time on your own without someone physically close to keep you focused on the deadlines. It will also help you become more self-motivated, a trait that will make you stand out in the workplace and beyond. For the disadvantage, are cheating prevention. Unfortunately, one of the biggest disadvantages of e-learning continues to be cheating. Through various methods compared to on-campus students, online students can cheat on assessment more easily as they take assessment in their own environment and while using their personal computer. The student cannot be directly observed during assessment without a video feed, making cheat detection during online assessment more complicated than for traditional testing procedures. Additionally, without a proper identified verification system in place, students taking online assessment might be able to let a third party take the assessment instead of themselves. For this cheating solution, in order to protect the authenticity of online education, 
anti-cheating measures must be put in place by an online educational institution. The most popular anti-cheating tools currently used in e-learning are online protectoring systems such as Examity, which use various anti-cheating measures such as automated ID verification. That is all from me. Thank you. Conclusion to our topic is online learning should be seen as a complement and extension of classical form of learning. Not even the best online course can fully replace the personal contact with a teacher or the human relationships that develop in a group. So, traditional class should not be replaced with online learning. There is no doubt that online class have been introduced to fill a particular gap in education sector. However, before joining the program, consider this process.